Hi everyone, it's Alexis Hasselberger, Time Management and Productivity Coach here. And today I want to talk to you a little bit about a book I just read called All You Have to Do is Ask by Wayne Baker. In full disclosure, I am quoted in this book, but I read the whole book, I thought it was great, and I thought I would share with you guys a little bit about what this book is about and how it could help you to increase your own productivity, because that's the uh, angle that I was coming at it from. So in this book, it's all about asking for what we need and how asking is a just a very simple process that we can do that really fast tracks our success in life. There is so much data and interesting stories and things in the book, but I did want to give you a few key takeaways because you know, asking is something that has been incredibly important in my life and for my success. You know, one of my the things my mom always said was, you don't get what you don't ask for. And I think I've really sort of taken that into um, my world. And I think this book really helped me solidify a lot of reasons for that. You know, I ask for things all the time, um, things that are going to help me to get where I need to go. You know, just the other day, I asked my friend Peter if he would help me to create a pivot table for my sales analytics because I'm really not that great at that. Uh, he was able to do in three minutes what probably would have taken me, I don't know, two hours to figure out on my own. Um, also, when I started group coaching and doing, you know, moving from individual to group coaching programs, I hadn't done that before. So I reached out to someone I knew in my network who had done a lot of group programs that she helped share with me advice that, you know, she had learned over the years and that really helped me fast track some things. So I think that, you know, when we do put ourselves out there to ask, even if it feels uncomfortable, even if we feel like we're going to seem weak or dumb, et cetera, all the reasons that we don't ask in the first place, we see that actually the opposite is true. When we ask for things, that increases others trust in us and it also gets us to where we're going a lot faster. So what are some key takeaways from this book that I wanted to share with you? Well the first thing is that asking just saves a ton of time in those examples that I just showed and money. There are so many different examples in this book about how money is actually saved by just asking because other people have resources that they may be willing to share with you that you just don't know about unless you ask, right? There's also a lot of information in this book about how do we ask in a way that just makes it easier and more likely for us to, to get help and to be able to help others. Things like just being really specific about your requests. If more somebody knows about what you need, the easier they'll be able to make those connections in their brain or to other people that they know. Also, giving deadlines is important. That's something I'm always talking about with my clients. How do we be more explicit about our deadlines, about our timelines, etc.? Because that puts everybody in a better position when we all know what we're being asked of and what's expected of us. And then finally, in this um, book, he really talks about this concept of a reciprocity ring, which is an exercise that um, Wayne Baker and Cheryl Baker had developed over time, which is very simple. Basically, you're in a group of people, each person asks for something that they need or need help with, and then all the other people in the group provide help if they can. It's a very simple exercise, but it's something that I think that any of us could take to any of the groups that we're part of. I mean, I'm you know, part of a couple of different book clubs. You know, I've got some entrepreneurs groups. There's all sorts of places um, that we are a part of, and I bet that taking this process of a reciprocity ring to any of those locations that you're already involved in would be something that could really um, help streamline the asking and giving cycle for all of you and really help you with some areas where you might have thought help didn't even exist. So this book, all you can do, all you have to do is ask. It was a great read for me. I read it in two days. Um, it's a great book. I think that everyone should read it. But if you don't have time to, or you just want those highlights, you can also just watch this video or check out my blog post at alexishasselberger.com. All right, bye.